Kiora. Welcome to Waste Some Time with Maggie. I've come on today with a catch-up for Woolly Steph. Excuse me, Woolly Steph's Art Club. And please excuse my <coughs> cough and nasally sound. I have a cold. Um, right, I we are the last one I did was circles. And the next one was metallics. So I did this one offline, and this is metallics. Just some metallic flowers. My inspiration has got up and left. And I suppose it's because I haven't been feeling well, but um, that is that one. And I'll just get some tape so we can tape that one down. And then the next one to be done is buttons and I have sort of done a bit of pit work on this one not going to be anything outstanding as I say my my muse is up and left <coughs> so I stayed home this weekend because my sister from the South Island was coming to visit but They've been in Wellington visiting their daughter and grandchildren for the last well, three or four days. And um, they were leaving this morning and their daughter came down with COVID. And they've had it, but they've been extra careful because we haven't. So they're not going to come until they get an, a negative test. So really... Mind you, the way I feel, I most probably wouldn't have wanted to go anywhere anyway. Right, so that is metallics. And I'll put that aside, I'll write in it later. And this one is buttons. Right, I have a background stamp here that is all buttons. So I think I'm going to put that down. It's going to be pretty basic, this, this one. I'm just going to tap it all and we're going to just do one on here just to see. Right, I think I need a good boss sponge. I'll be back. Right, I'm back and I have put my um, stamp down on my stamping block here. And I'll just Stamp it up again, and hopefully this will stamp out right a little bit better than it did on the other. Right, let me see, make sure we're in the right spot. Give it a Give it a moment to grab everywhere, hopefully. Hmm. Not exactly perfect, but not too bad. So I'll put that out of there and we'll give it a bit of a dry off. Right, I am back and I've got that. Now I think that I'm going to just get a little brush and I'm going to brush on a few colours. I'm going to use my sprays I've got here. A few pretty colours. Alright, I'm just going to put a bit of colour around it. Just take that off. I'm really just going to put a little bit of colour around. It's not going to it's not going to pick anything out. It's just going to be brushed around like a bit of watercolour. Just to give us a bit of colour in the background basically. <coughs> The bugs are really travelling around at the moment. My daughter has been 
quite sick for about three weeks now. Have her back to the hospital again this week, but it's got more more antibiotics and um, prednisone, and hopefully she'll start to feel a bit better. But because she's got no sick days, because she's just started back into the workforce, she can't afford to take time off work, so it's a little bit difficult. This is not going to be anything really fantastic, but hopefully it'll Ooh, got a little bit bit of that um what do you call it? Mica from down on the bottom on that one. It's rather nice. Very delicate pink. Alright, now what else have we got here? We've got I don't know what the colour of this one is. Let's have a look at it. Oh, I think that might be black. I don't think they want black. And this one here is I think this one is a blue. Yes. Yes. Maybe I'll brush a bit of a wash off. Purpley blue. Oh, that is nice too. Okay. I'm quite liking that. Put the lid back on that one. And our last one here. A deeper orange. Just put a little bit of that on the end there. Take it off a bit. Right. It doesn't look too bad. I'll dry it off and I'll be back. Right, I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to um, stamp over it again. Hopefully I've pretty much got it in the same place. And we will go down again if I stuff it up. Wow. And yep, we basically did. But I don't mind it actually. It just looks like scribbly buttons. And I'm not unhappy with it. So that, we're going to carry on with that. <coughs> Excuse me. Now I have got some buttons that I punched out. And my thing is going to be called buttons and bows. I have threaded some little trim through them. Just, I didn't do this online because it took me quite a while. Right. Trim these off. I think we 
move them around a bit. And one more. Sure, so we want all five on, or just the three big ones. Really, not sure. Right. I think I might get rid of that. And I think that's pretty much what I'm going to do. <coughs> As I say, nothing starting. I'm sure I can bring you up some more. Oops, wrong way. The metallics, um, or the mica is showing up quite a bit there, but never mind. This is what we're going to do. I'm pretty sure I'm just going to glue these down. And this will be our buttons page. my um, buttons are just bits of old card I had and some jelly prints it's the first time I've really made buttons so we will get a marker and yeah, let's put a little border around it right. I'm quite liking it what it looks like. I think it's that way around actually. I'll just turn that over. Right, I'm back and I've got my tape. This is my first um, bulky one I think. don't usually do bulk ones. And both of these have got just a little bit of okay you like that and I'm quite happy with that <coughs> excuse me This one is metallic. And this one is buttons. Right. There's my two catch up pages. 
I'm not unhappy with them. Thank you for being with me. Kia kaha, stay strong, and I'll catch you again soon.